you use the term first responder, okay? When you use the term first responder, you normally think of fire and police. Well, I gotta tell you something. When you use the term first responder in Lake Charles, you gotta include the public works department. We've done a great job with bringing a lot of our supervisors and superintendents together, getting them to cross train and getting them to understand what other departments do and that they can depend on them and they have to be able to do that. They have to be able to work together. And that's that's what's, um, as the mayor pointed out, how big of an organization it is and what we do for the city. I want the guys from vehicle maintenance. You never see these guys. Come on up here, vehicle maintenance. Come on up here. Now, you know something? When she tells you what they did, you, then you look at these big, scruffy guys, and, you know, don't let them fool you, you know, because they have a heart of gold, um, what they came up with. This is just some of them, but one, we had to leave some of them back to keep the shop running. <laughs> so, um, Belinda, she's going to elaborate a little bit on what they did. With our monetary donations, we bought some uh, children's DVDs. And we also have, in about two weeks, it'll be in, and we're going to also bring you a, a children's table from a, uh, the Department of Public Works, Vehicle Maintenance and Transit. But I would like to say thank you to this group in particular that you found it in your hearts to think of us during the week when you should be celebrating yourselves. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'd also like to take a minute and invite you. To, it's, it's really interesting. You, This is your week. Well, it's also our week. Uh, this is uh, hospital week, and uh, we're having a barbecue today. And uh, we'd like to invite you to come have barbecue with us. None of us can exist without the other. Public Works needs a hospital. Hospital needs Public Works. And you can go on and on and on and on and draw you know, just get down into the weeds of it and we're all independent interdependent on each other and you look out across this broad cross section of people when you see it you're looking at this group as i'm looking at the group it's just amazing to see the different groups that are represented here different people represented here different talents and abilities but it takes everybody in this room and then some in order to make a community a community